Hello everybody, I'm Lance Goyke and today we're talking about using push-ups as an upper body power test. So I, you know, this is a very simple variation. I figured it out because I read it in Joel Jameson's Ultimate MMA Conditioning book, which has a lot of different conditioning methods that you can try for any sort of sport or even any sort of like normal person just trying to work out, um, even if you're not doing MMA. But one of those is a max power output in 10 seconds test. So generally you can try as hard as humanly possible for 10 seconds and not be too gassed afterwards. Um, so what we're trying to see is how efficient is that process? How, how much power can I output from a work standpoint and from a just ATP energy standpoint? Um, so if you're gonna do this test, you gotta know how to do push-ups. And if I'm gonna go quick, I'm gonna take my socks off so I don't slide. Uh, basically, you, you have to have it automatic because you're about to be going with max intensity. You can't think about your technique here. So I've got 90 something other videos for you to watch on push-up technique. <sighs> okay. So let me make sure I'm not gonna hit my head. I'm just gonna set up. And I don't really have a clock, so you can time me and see if I get 10 seconds. But this is basically what it looks like, the things I do for you guys. So not too winded, that wasn't really that bad. Um, sorry, you had to hear me breathe. Uh, the idea here is you have to be, you can't just be rigid. You can't just be locked down, right? You can't, it's not like a single rep bench press where you're just keeping everything tight. You have to be kind of fluid. So when I get to the uh, top or almost to the top, maybe even not even almost, maybe like halfway up, I have to start shutting everything off because my force is pushing me up to the top and I don't want to shoot my hands off the ground. I gotta kill my energy. So I start to shut down and maybe I don't totally lock out my elbows, but that's okay because I don't wanna really forcefully lock out my elbows just for this test anyway. Um, so I get up there and I start shutting down. And then once I get to the bottom, I gotta, I gotta keep everything shut down and almost try to pull myself back down. But once I get to the bottom, I gotta turn everything on as fast as humanly possible. <laughs> Um, and so you, you're trying to basically teach yourself how to stop on a dime. Don't just do this if you've never done any quick reps. Uh, I mean, I guess you can, but it's more likely you're going to strain your pec if you're doing something quick like this. It's quick. You're lengthening it. There's just a lot of stress on that tissue. So maybe work up to it. Maybe don't do 10 whole seconds. Maybe start with six. Um, you can do repeats uh, six seconds with... 30 seconds of rest, that's a really good variation to try. Um, but cool, I'm sure my technique didn't look that great, but it's a power test, it's whatever. <laughs> uh, that is the upper body power test, 10 second push-ups.